business out there. <laughs> Floyd and Louise are in love. Come on, Floyd. Give it a feel, honey. Only problem is, Floyd doesn't know it yet. It's different, Louise, you know, uh, physical desire. Uh, something the man just can't uh, even do any control over, you know, your hungry need. Everybody else does. I heard the whole thing. It was just talking, that's all it was, it was just talking. Sound like no language. <laughs> but Floyd, he's not in any hurry. I guess since I have nothing to do all day, I'll call up old Virgil Stimps and see what he's got going on. Why don't you do that? In fact, Floyd hasn't been in much of a hurry to do anything since his wife died last year. You want me to call him back then? No, don't call him back on my account. You want to date a prefer? Date a prefer. <laughs> Except maybe feel sorry for himself, that is. In case I don't see you again. I hope you take really good care of yourself. And as luck would have it, even that hasn't been going too well lately. You know, why don't you just take your problems and your heartaches and all your whole goddamn place and shove them up your ass? Uh-huh, get off my property. I am, damn it. Go on, get off! So it seems that Floyd's kind of stuck here in Blue Water with his ailing bar. You could make this place work again, you know that? With my help, you could make this place work again. His aging father-in-law. I know I was. No damn movies! I don't want to watch you watch no damn movies, neither. And his determined girlfriend. And you should tell me that you love me sometime, Floyd, since you do. And if he's not real careful... You know, Louise, a woman won't take no for an answer. He may just find... I don't want you to go home. You don't? ...that his life isn't half as bad... What the hell is wrong with you, man? ...as he hoped it would be. Partners! <laughs> Full moon in blue water. In 1972, Lieutenant Colonel Isiel Hamilton was shot down on a surveillance mission over hostile territory. Stranded behind enemy lines, there is nothing for him to do but sit very still, listen very hard, and pray for the voice of a friend he has never met. Bird dog, bird dog, this is Bat 2-1. Are you in the vicinity? Bat 21. There would be no pickup today. Jungle is too hot. Negative, it's gotta be today. Hamilton is one of our top people. The communist will have a dossier on him, left thick. Let's get the basic relationship down. I'm the lifeguard, you're the drowning man. She's spending more time in the air than on Mother Earth. All I want to do is bring the old man back. Bird dog, could you do me a personal favor? Get in touch with my wife. She'd be scared to death. You won't make it. They're gonna blast the whole damn area. Jeez. Friend. Friend. Oh! Burned off. I killed a man today. I didn't want to do it. That 2 one I never met you. But you don't sound like a killer. I gotta go up again. I gotta find him. Bird is hot! Bird dog, they're walking him out into the minefield. Get him to tell where I am. I'm gonna give myself up. Laying in the mud. Now get back on course. Gene Hackman. I've been in the service most of my adult life. It's the first time I ever saw any war. Danny Glover. He's being told I can't do something. War isn't always about enemies. Bat 21, based on a true story. Infidels, subversives, seducers, wantons, all. What lively company. They lived the first summer of love. Sally! Let's not live to be old. Let the grim tyrant take us in youth. Lord Byron and Shelley, poets living in exile. To attack God, King, and marriage in one piece is quite an accomplishment. The outrage <laughs> and the envy of high society. He considers us brothers and sisters of the revolution. For one summer, they were tied in the bonds of friendship. He is the greatest poet of the age. And its greatest scandal. For one summer, they were enriched in the danger of their own lives. Glimpse the demon behind the mask. Mary loves you. Mary loves you. Ah! There's the terrible danger in this, Shelley. I will go wherever experience takes me. I must. To feeling tremblingly alive. The story of poets Byron and 
Shelley and their summer of friendship. A summer that would forever change their lives. A summer the world would never forget. Philip Anglum, Laura Dern, Alice Krieger, Eric Stoltz, and Alex Winter. An Avon Passer film, Haunted Summer.